Well, one of my favorite little birds, a beautiful pearl spotted owl, uh, pearl spotted owlet, and again spotted by Craig. Uh, Craig uh, is getting really good at spotting these little owls, but that's a lovely view, and you can actually see he's got those two black spots behind the head, you can see them clearly. Uh, they appear to look like eyes. I wonder where this, what this little owl is looking at. Uh, we know they do catch little insects and rodents. Right, but he's right at the top of that tree. Beautiful, tiny, tiny little owl. Oh, we've been lucky with spotting them at the moment this time of year. It's a bit easier. There's not as much foliage around, so they stand out a little bit more. But they are still, it's not always easy. It's, it's still difficult, and you hear them a lot. But it's so wonderful to see these little owls. I really, really do enjoy them. And yesterday we had the African barred owlet, and now the African scops owlet. Sorry, pearl spotted owlet. Oh, you see, I'm losing my mind. <laughs> it's a pearl spotted owlet, everyone. So I do apologize. And the other little one that we get in this area is the Scops Owl. Um, the Scops Owl, which uh, which is also about the same size, slightly smaller. Some books say they're similar in size. Um, some say the Scops Owl is slightly smaller than the Pearl Spotted Owl. But all tiny, tiny little owls. There, look at the face. He's facing us now. You can see that little beak. His beautiful eyes. Oh, that is really great. That is very special. That's made my afternoon. Um, Angel, you say you love owls. Well, I'm so glad we are able to show you a little pearl spotted owlet. Oh, isn't that nice? Look at that right up in the back of that tree perfect perfect spot well and Craig and lovely to see it I'm so glad we got to show you right we're gonna move off